welcome back to another video on my channel i haven't vlogged in a while just wanted to come on here and do a little bit of an intro because this week is the craziest week there's like two graduations i didn't get to vlog my brothers because i can't even go i'm so mad then it's my sister's high school graduation then literally right after there's going to be a lebanese festival happening in canada and if i have never mentioned this before the church where i am the church i attend where i live it doesn't do lebanese festivals anymore after covid they were like goodbye we're never gonna do one again well, I don't know that, but I was so upset for so long and then I thought one year I just figured why not go to a different state or a different country even, Canada, to attend a Lebanese festival. Why am I holding myself back? Why am I limiting myself to just my location? It gives me a good excuse to go on vacation and to get a Lebanese festival out of it. It is a win-win situation. Um, yeah. This weekend, I am going to Canada with a group of people and we're going to sleep over Canada just to make it a little bit more fun. I've been to this festival last year, but I didn't sleep. I basically had to drive back to where I live in the middle of the night, it took forever. I got home super, super late. It was not fun being on the road basically all day. You want to enjoy your time, spend it, relax. I can stay as long as I want at the festival because my hotel will be right next door. Now you guys are all caught up with my week, I think. I might be forgetting something. Oh, Oh, it's my cousin's graduation party tonight. I have so much going on. I don't know what I will be vlogging, but I know for a fact I will vlog the Canada trip to the Lebanese festival. Yeah, I just wanted to give an intro now. I don't know if I'll have time to intro later. I will be packing a small bag. I will go to the festival on Saturday, the Saturday. Next morning, I'm going to church, a Maronite Catholic church in Canada. Later, Sunday, I will attend the festival again, because if you didn't know, a lot of festivals can actually go on for multiple days in a row. I think this one's a three-day festival, but I do want to attend two of the days, so Saturday and Sunday, and I'll get to actually live the festival to the fullest because it's not my own festival so just so unfortunate because typically I'd be getting ready for the festival like the prep is so much fun I get to dance I know my community it's so much fun for months you're practicing a dance for months you're prepping for a festival or you're working at a certain food booth or game booth or whatever it's a lot of fun to see that process happening that disappears when you go to a different festival because you're not a part of that community so you have no way of being involved the whole involvement just disappears goes out the window i just rambled i was at work today i have two jobs i work with my dad and i also work as a graphic designer at my university <coughs> student graphic designer position inshallah i get a higher position and i just keep working with them because they're so much fun and they're such a great group they're so welcoming they make you feel comfortable and i like being around them and i also love what i do i love designing for my university planning out whatever the case may be Okay, enough about me. I have to get going. See you at the end of the week. I love you guys. Goodbye. I have to show you my outfits. Hold on. You guys, I'm deleting like all my videos because if I want to actually blow up, I need to have my videos be perfection. The one thing that's holding me back, the funny things that happen in my videos. I'm like, how can I delete this? It's hilarious, but it's embarrassing at the same time. Green shirt, kind of pretty nationalistic if you ask me. I don't think we're gonna go with it. And my personal favorite, it's a halter top. It's a little expose, which is why I need to wear something under. today is that I'm basically going to be transferring from a blue towel robe to a blue towel dress and you'll see what I'm talking about. This is so comfortable that I basically bought a dress that looks exactly like this. Let's do a little bit of a transformation. Remember this robe, just remember it. I'm about to switch into something just like it, just a little bit more wearable. <laughs> What did I say? It's very long and paper towel-y actually turned out good for once. So this can be in a bow tie like this or it could be like this. What do we think? My mom said this is better. Now I can't wear a necklace. I still need jewelry. You want to see the whole dress? It's a very long dress. It goes down to my ankles. This is the final look. I decided to go with this being tied in a little bow. I think that's the best way to dress this. Where's the back? 
yeah so just go check out my shorts if you want to see more of this outfit where did i get this dress from i got it from macy's if you want to go get it i'm so proud of my sister i feel like just yesterday she was a little baby and now she's graduating i can't even believe it and when you have a lot of siblings it's like boom 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 somebody graduates somebody gets married nobody got married yet somebody graduates from middle school my brother just graduated from middle school sister's graduating from high school it's crazy but um i'm such a proud older sister i'm just so proud of them i can't wait to watch them walk down the aisle all of them when it is their high school grad i am ready to go i don't know about you i'm running late and i'm already sweating Help. <laughs> officially canada day running a tad bit late so i kind of got to speed up this whole thing i already got ready you guys missed everything quite literally her duffel bag this is a one night we're like why do we pack the same amount whether it's one night or a month i don't know because you need the same hygiene this is every day. hold up the only difference is clothes that's my bag why is it that big why is it that why is it this heavy fanny pack jewelry if you have it already on you don't have to worry about it honestly oh weighing me down Ah! Loading the bags in the trunk. I'm so excited. It's so windy though. It's such a windy day. Ah. Okay, I think we're ready. My hair's so frizzy, but what can you do when you're a curly head and you straighten it? That's what you gotta deal with. My neighbor's staring at me. Ah! Hurry up. Stuffed my purse. I have a mini sketchbook. You guys, this is our first time road tripping. Yeah. We're about to go pick up Mary and Maria. And my car smells like mold. Oh! <gasps> This is nice. And it'll be nice. Okay. This is the fit. And I'm in love with Thank you. You look so good. I love Maria. Ahla. Ahla Maria. Ahla. Okay. Wait. We're going to show you guys the fits. Guys, come to the window. So. Oh, I think I did show the feet. Oh, you. Okay. So, I am wearing a Jaguar shirt. Okay. Time. Oh. Okay, this is a fanny pack my aunt got me. Some gold jewelry and green Converse. Guys, I'm wearing a Halloween outfit. I don't know oh why. Halloween. <laughs> <Halloween. laughs> oh, I got a fanny pack and this is the fit. I'm wearing a regular basic outfit. Jeans. These are from um, TJ Maxx, but they're Michael Kors. This Period. is from Shein. It this is so from nice. Cold. Um, jewelry from Lebanon. Oh, okay. So pretty. Hello, this is my fit check. I'm white. I like this. I love it. It gives it a little color. Yeah. Cool. I hope this trip will turn out as expected. Um, I learned my lesson and we're on the fifth floor. Good thing this time. No 47th floor. I'm not gonna tell them what floor we're on because they might find us, but. Right here, but they're playing English songs, and I don't know. I gotta stop vlogging.
currently 1 a.m. and we're going out. I think we're just gonna walk around the city. We're getting rushed, so we kinda gotta go. We need to put a key card, I think. Guys, back in the back in the hotel. These are my PJs. One sec. We need to stay up. It's 4 a.m. Good morning. Um, <laughs> I don't know what to say. We went to sleep at like 5 a.m. Or yeah. had a noise complaint once again. No, this is This happens to us everywhere we go. The now we're going security. to church. And right now it's four. Four. So we got four I'm hours four. of sleep. Good anyways. Like this. It's like a thing we're one. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, oh, uh, that's so... Like this, or I do it that thoroughly. So do it thoroughly. Yeah. But if somebody else is doing it, then I'll do it. If yeah. no one's doing it, I'll. Doing our Sunday fit check. Green shirts, flowy pants, and shop. Hi, Thomas. Cute. Wait, we're both in. Yeah. Guys. I should have recorded this scene. Well, we're gonna go get my car and then we're going, we're heading to church. So. We're in 10 minute traffic because the boys took forever to get to church. To church! I know what you're gonna do. Officially back at home. I bought this shirt from the mall. April said it looks like pajamas. April said it looks like pajamas, but I'm gonna have to style it a bit differently, I think, since I'm wearing it as not pajamas. Okay, I barely vlogged the last. I barely vlogged the festival that was today. It was freezing and beyond blame.